it's Tracy. So our workout today is in honor of spring. I want to make sure that you are feeling sexy and confident, ready to wear your skinniest jeans or maybe even bold enough to wear some booty shorts. So I hope that you like the workout. Make sure that you do it all the way through. And if you like it, make sure to leave your comments below. Okay, so for today's workout for your skinny jeans and booty short preparation, all you need are some light weights. So today I'm using my twos. You can do anywhere between one and five. I would say that's completely fine, okay? So we're just gonna start with an easy squat here. Keep your legs parallel, bring the weights out diagonally forward, and just come up and squeeze your butt. Forward and squeeze. Make sure to let your butt go back here, as always, really important. And be sure when you're standing up, that's when you squeeze that booty forward here and squeeze. Keep going. That's it. You should feel. I'm already feeling my butt shaking here. And squeeze. And squeeze. That's it. Good. Let's do a second set like that. And forward. Squeeze. Good. Forward. And squeeze. Keep going. Squeeze it. That's it. And squeeze. Good. Three more like this. Forward. And squeeze. You got it. Forward. Good. And last one. Okay, good. So now we're going to do a little side squat. So bend one knee. Make sure it's tracking forward. You're going to reach your weights down towards the floor. Come up. Balance on one leg. Bring the weights to your shoulder. And this is in your little attitude position like a dancer. Okay? So we're going to go forward. Swoop up. Okay? Forward. Swoop it up. Good. And three. And up. Good. Four. Really kind of lead with that heel. It's like you're trying to kick a ball or something over to the side there. Good. We'll call this five. And again, six. Excellent. Good. And seven. Ooh, feel that work. Eight. Across. Good. Two more. And across. Last one. So now stay here. Bring the weights down in, in the center as you bring the leg up to the side. And then do a bicep curl as you cross, okay? So it's down and cross. And open, cross. You got it. And three. Good. And four. You got it. That's it. And five. Keep your dumbbells pulled in. Good. And again, seven. And eight. Good. Two more. That's it. Last one. If you lose your balance, no big deal. Okay, good. So let's do that on the other side. So down, swoop across. Good. Down and swoop. And three. Good. Really reach out there. You got it. And five. You feeling it? And up. That's it. Seven. Swoop. Really pulling your abs. That's really going to help your balance, I promise. Keep those shoulders down. So now stay here. Weights come down as you open. And then up. This one's a little bit more challenging. We'll see if I can keep my balance. So, you're gonna take your legs together, really squeeze them together here. Lift up into a releve, or if you don't know what that means, just lift up your heels, okay? Squat down, trying to keep those knees together. Like you're holding a little piece of paper between your knees. Bring your arms forward here, and you're gonna do a little row. So dip down a little bit lower, come up just a little bit. On this one, less is more. So you don't wanna do too much movement here. Worst case scenario, you lose your balance, you just lower your heels, okay? Or if that feels too much, you can do this with your heels down, okay? So for extra challenge and to really work your full leg here, keep those heels lifted, okay? Takes a lot of abdominal strength here. And up, down, and up, you got it. And up, so notice I'm going down just a little lower and up and down. Keep my abs tight, your abs are tight. Our abs are tight together. And up. That's it. Good. So you want to do about 15 of these. I'm going to call this eight. I have no idea how many we did. Nine, but that's okay. It's called creative. Good. Five more like this. And five. Creative counting. And four. Good. Three. You got it. Two more. Two. And last one. Okay, good. So let's let go of one of your weights. 
Come into a wide position here. We have a special guest. That's Junior. You're going to go down here, past the way through, and down and up and down and four. He always likes to be in the room when I'm working out. And so instead of hiding him away, he just wants to say hello to you. And down there he is. And nine, baby. And last one, but let's switch to the other side. So pass it through and down. You got to keep your turn up. Down and down. Are your legs burning? Mine are on fire, but it's so worth it. Three more. Three and two. Get that nice wide plie. Last one. Okay, good. Excellent. So we're going to go into a little butt out plie here. So go into a plie. Press through a little punch. Down, press and punch. Really squeeze your butt when you come up. And make sure you can twist your upper body, but you don't want to twist your hips so that we get some oblique, okay? It's always really great to do those multi-purpose exercises, right? Working lots of different things at once. And get your butt down. I feel those inner thighs. How about you? Down, whoo, and down. You can do it. Keep your abs tight. Make sure that you don't arch the back here. Good. And across. And good. That's it. Excellent. Let's do two more sets like that. And good. So now for some fun. Drop the weights down. And now we're going to do a little dance here. So just pulsing here. Tiny pulse. Four. You got it. Five. Okay. Keep that external rotation. And nine. Okay, good. So now you're going to get your hips moving side to side here. Do a little reach and reach. Good. And five, seven, nine. So now two on one side. Two times. Other side. Two times. And reach. Notice how I'm staying low here. So yes, I'm moving my hips, but I'm not coming up, okay? I'm staying down and low. Good. That's it. One more set like that. Good. So now you're going to bring your hips forward and back and forward. That's it. Forward and forward. Keep your turn out. And five. Abs are tight. Six. Really move your pelvis here. Seven and eight. Nine. Good. Let's go back to that single side to side. Side to side. Ooh, I've lost it. Try that again. Side and side. You got it. And reach. Reach across. Reach. That's it. Eight, good, nine, and excellent. Let's do double, and double, and double. That's it, double. Stay down low. I know it's burning, but it's good for you. Cross, and cross. That's it. Good. One more set here. Good. And now forward and back. Forward and back, and forward, and forward. Keep your turn out. Forward. That's it. Five. And six, seven, perfect, and eight, and nine, last one, and excellent. So there you have it. I hope that you definitely are feeling your legs. And make sure for best results that you're doing your cardio and that you're eating a really nice, clean diet. Now, if you have questions and are not quite sure what it is you should be eating or how you should be working out, I want to invite you to click on this link below. My program, Four Weeks to Your Hottest Body Ever, begins on April 21st. So if you are ready to have this summer be your summer and you're feeling your most beautiful and confident, and additionally, you're ready to ditch dieting forever, you're sick and tired of having any kind of shame around your body, and you're ready to really invest in yourself because you're ready finally, right now, to have your body and your life be equally amazing, then this is the program for you. So make sure to click the link here, and if you have any questions at all, as always, feel free to email me at tracy at tracycampoli.com.